Hey everyone, welcome to another review. I'm Jenny. So this time I am review, re, excuse me, reviewing um, another Oracle deck. This one is called Witch's Wisdom Oracle Cards by Barbara. I'm, I apologize if I butcher her last name. Michael Johnfrey and Flavia Kate Peters. Um, they are based out of, these authors are based out of the UK, I believe. But I absolutely love this deck. I will, these authors have created actually a few decks, uh, and I do have, but this was the first one of theirs that I've received. Um, I will use this deck a lot around Halloween, quite honestly, um, but really whenever I feel called to. But so, let me take out, so I'll show you first the accompanying booklet, okay? It's not, it's not a very big booklet. Um, it does give a few spreads in the beginning, uh, like a pentagram, so, can't hold it right, like a pentagram spread. Um, and then it lists the card messages, you know, and it shows the card um, in a pretty detailed meaning towards it, giving which is wisdom, which is foresight, and then what, uh, some history behind each of the cards. So, and I mean, very easy to follow along, quite honestly, very helpful. These cards themselves, they're, they're pretty big, okay? They're like, you know, the size of my hand almost, okay? So, you can, you can shuffle them, I shuffle them like the long way. You know, depending on the size of your hands, I can't hold them very well this way. But they are outlined in like a silvery sheen, if you will. Um, you can shuffle them like normal playing cards. Very lightweight. But so I'm going to show you a few of the cards here. Very colorful, honestly, very colorful. Vibrant spell we have here. Wand or intention. Witch healer. I just love these cards. There's something very magical about them. Hearth, homecoming. I really do recommend these, especially for, um, I'll say even for like a beginner witch, if you will. Someone sort of new into this path and is kind of trying to get their feel, get their get their vibe, see where their energy, you know, takes them. But, um, you know, I really like this deck. It's fun and easy to use, perfect to use, like I said, around Halloween. <laughs> Tis the season, right? Especially for all of this type of work. But so, this is a really, really nice deck. Like I said, they do have, uh, Barbara and Flavia do have a few decks out, which I, I have, and I will be reviewing at a later date. But I really wanted to provide um, a little review on this one right now. I'm, just, I'm not gonna show you, obviously, all the cards, but. And these cards also touch upon the Sabbaths, um, let me see if I can find, oh, as well as, uh, the elements, earth, air, fire, water, spirit, like here's air, and it means imagination in this deck. But so, one of the Sabbaths, like Sawen, okay, which never obviously means death, it just means change or transformation, right? We also have Ostara, which is actually the next one coming up incubation right yes incubation but so these cars are just wonderful they also have included um, the directions as well watchtower of the east which is spring there's you know north west and south as well so really these um it's a fun deck honestly it's a really fun deck great to use if you want to tap into your witchy side if you will um, I, I do suggest you, you get it. I believe you can purchase it. You can definitely purchase this in some stores. Um, I believe you can also get them on Amazon. If you can't get it 
on Amazon, then I would just actually Google the authors. Uh, I believe they have their own website as well, so you can definitely get it that way. And like I said, I believe they're out of the UK. So, all right, that is it for my review of the Witch's Wisdom Oracle deck. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys pick up this deck because it's, it's really fun. It really is. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.